so proud of him. So happy for him. Um, I got emotional in my little post-game speech out there. Uh, just the trials and tribulations that he's been throughout this year. Obviously missing one um, early in the day, um, hitting the pole on another. You know, he could easily put it in the tank. And 61-yard um, field goal to win a game against a division rival. Um, it's what stories are made of. And uh, I love him. I, I respect him so much. Everybody in that locker room is so happy for him. And um, he's our guy. Can you walk us through what happens in that moment? Like, and as the kick is about to be attempted, what are you doing? We see you celebrate afterwards, but what are you doing during it? Do you watch? Do you not watch? Oh, yeah, I watched it. Um, just, you know, saying a little prayer. Um, and as soon as it goes in, you know, there's five seconds left, so I'm screaming, everybody get off the field because we got to kick off and get a play done. And our defense went out there, and Greg Rousseau, Greg Rousseau ex executed very well. Josh. Yeah, those are three guys that just constantly do the right thing, that are in the right spot. Um, you know, they're, they're working their tails off. Those are also three guys that are heavy on special teams. Um, so, you know, we, we, we know the mantra, what we've been saying uh, each and every week since training camp. Um, and it's just the, the epitome of what our offense is. And it doesn't matter who it is. It could be anybody on any given day. And um, that's what we saw today. Had a few touches, but had, I want to say, 90 yards. Just what was he doing that was making him so effective in uh, his game? I mean, just obviously you see him catching passes out of the backfield. Um, he runs the ball so hard. Um, you know, he just again knows his assignment and he does his job, and that's that's all you need to do in this offense. Keon had that drop early on, what led to the interception. What were the conversations like after that? Obviously, you went back to him again, but what was that kind of like? Just talking to him after that play? Yeah, just you know, trusting him. Um, Third and long, biggest play of the game, throw one up for him. Uh, obviously, we get the flag uh, to extend the, extend the drive, but um, I trust him implicitly and um, love the guy, and uh, hopefully he's okay. This is the fifth time you guys have trailed at the half this season. I know you don't want to be in those positions, but do you now feel comfortable in them, or at least a little bit more comfortable? Well, we want to start fast, you know, and that's, um, you know, been our, our Achilles heel, and we feel like we're, we're the best, our best in the third and fourth quarter, getting off to a hot start. Um, but if we can if we can put that out in the first and second quarter, we're going to be a, a tough team to beat. To that point, it seemed like they did a lot of things with pressure and some variations there that were giving you some problems, at least in the first half until you guys dealt with Yeah, I mean, I, I honestly, it was a, a pretty big zone game, um, whether it was zone pressure or not. You know, they were really forcing us to take everything underneath and hoping that we'd mess up. And um, again, just trusting the guys underneath to catch and run. and. Um, made some big plays uh, on the play action pass game, just checking it down. And um, that's what you can be a dangerous team that way, too. Josh, this one had a different feel than maybe the Titans game or the Seahawks game. It seemed like you had to grit it out a little bit more. What's it say when you win a game like this and maybe you didn't have your fastball? Yeah, I mean, I, this game's hard. You know, the other team, they get paid as well. Um, I'd like to be better, obviously, in the first half. Uh, and I'd like to be better in that, that two-minute drive. Didn't feel like, again, like you said, didn't have the fastball. But um, again, just gutted it out. Uh, Matt Collins, going back to him on, on two consecutive plays. They're on third down, too, just trusting him. Um, so yeah, again, it, it could be anybody. And, and our guys made some plays today that uh, we needed.